ही स्ट्राइव फॉर वन थिंग एंड कीप परस्यूइंग इट फॉर अ रिपीटेडली लाइक एज द सेइंग गोज ट्राई ट्राई टिल यू सक्सीड एंड लाइक इन बाय डूइंग यंत्रा आई टोटली बिलीव ऑन द सेइंग बिकॉज लाइक मेनी ऑफ टाइम्स हम लोग ऐसे थे कि अरे ये प्रॉब्लम तो सॉल्व हो ही नहीं सकता हो ही नहीं सकता बट लाइक आफ्टर वी ऑल वर्क ऑन इट ऐसा कोई प्रॉब्लम नहीं जिसका सोल्यूशन नहीं है सो आई टोटली बिलीव ऑन दीज टू कंसेप्ट ना कि इफ यू वर्क ऑन एनी थिंग लाइक एंड टोटली डेडिकेट योर माइंड एंड लाइक थिंक अबाउट इट कीप ऑन थिंकिंग अबाउट इट यू विल इवेंचुअली गेट इट सोल्यूशन दे वर मोमेंट्स दैट वी ऑलमोस्ट ऑलमोस्ट गिव अप ऑन थिंग्स बट देन द वेरी नेक्स्ट डे वी फेल्ट लाइक दैन वी हैव टू विन कम ऑन कम ऑन एंड देन वी स्टार्टेड बैक अगैन एंड देन वी आर टूडे एट फाइनल्स ऑफ द यंत्रा एंड वी आर प्राउड ऑफ वट वी हैव मेड मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट थिंग दैट आई नोटिस वॉज दैट आई वॉज एंड कॉन्फिडेंट इनफ टू प्रेजेंट माई आइडियाज और प्रेजेंट एनी थिंग दैट आई हैव मेड Uh, but today i think uh, i have no such inconfident feelings that uh, during the presentation of the bot while building a team we should keep in mind ki uh, sabka apna apna ek character hota hai everybody has his own way of living so thode ups and downs rehte hai you should go with it and ek team ko jode rakhne ki sabne koshish karni chahiye every team member should be uh, you know equally involved and equally be felt as a part of the team in the alpha bot the wlf sensors through which uh, we followed the line were very close so the problem was uh, sometimes it took three readings sometimes it took four readings on the node it was different so for uh, sometimes we used to uh, get the node detect the node and sometimes we used to not so what we did was we approached in a different way we were using cameras for color detection so we thought of using it for node detection as well so the nodes were red in color so we uh, started to detect the nodes also with the help of camera and we completely discarded the approach of uh, variable readings and went for a fixed reading with camera इंजीनियरिंग में आते ही लोग ये कोर्स करने लगते हैं वो कोर्स करने लगते हैं लोगों को एक्स्ट्रा करिकुलर चीज़ें सीखने रहती है तो आई थिंक वन ऑफ द बेस्ट वेज टू लर्न एक्स्ट्रा करिकुलर थिंग्स इज थ्रू ई यंत्रा ई यंत्रा हमको क्या करता है हमको सिखाता भी है लर्निंग रिसोर्सेज भी देता है चैलेंजेस भी रहते हैं एक्सरसाइजेस भी रहते हैं और साथ में डेडलाइंस भी रहते हैं तो यू नीड टू लर्न अबाउट दिस एज वेल एज इम्प्लीमेंट पीपल्स इज द बेस्ट वे टू लर्न इज थ्रू प्रैक्टिकल इम्प्लीमेंटेशन आई थिंक ई यंत्रा इज वन ऑफ द परफेक्ट एग्जाम्पल्स ऑफ प्रैक्टिकल इम्प्लीमेंटेशन मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग दट आई लर्न वॉज इफ इट वर्क ऑन पेपर इट वॉन्ट वर्क on real world it's not necessary like you have to do multiple iterations from going from theory to like practice while making changes into hardware we usually like initially we used to make uh, permanent changes so like uh, using super glue making the permanent change which couldn't be reversed back after some time if it didn't work we had to like restart from zero and start again so rather than that like what we used to do in later stages is uh, use materials that can be reversed back initially we had stuck the servo motor using fabric so when the servo motor to stop working after some time we had to change it to change it uh, it couldn't come off the plastic so we had to cut the whole part and join again so in the later stages we use a glue gun hot glue gun instead of fabric that challenging at the first messy in the middle but rewarding at the end why would i say that because when you are doing a theme in yantra the things that you are learning may be new to you it's going to be difficult it's going to be overwhelming you will feel like oh my god i'm not being going to be able to do this the messy in the middle because yes because for the stage to when the hardware comes what's on the paper is not going to work always and you it's going to be messy it's going to require time it's going to require sweat it's going to require effort most importantly it's going to require critical thinking and a very good observation skills to think about all the small details that can go wrong or that are going wrong and the last thing is is definitely rewarding at the end the experience and the learning that you learn in the entire process is itself rewarding you get attitude to learn different new things patience level increases and you look at things in a more objective manner that's what i can feel